in my inventory it took up all my space so i like i'd have no i'd have to like leave shit on my scav because i didn't have the room for it it's like dude okay either i gotta spend 8.5 mil on upgrading my stash check my oh i can't do that anyway because fucking jaeger is blocking it because of course he is like well i can't do that like okay uh how much for weapon cases five mil uh huh great how much for thick weapon cases 10 mil I'm like oh Okay, what do I prefer? Thick or n normal? It's like, okay, thick gives me 50. Uh, or, excuse me, thick gives me 90. Normal gives me 50. So I was like, if I'm going to pay, you know, this half the price, or double the price for not double the space, I'm just going to buy a normal one. So I bought the uh, default weapons case. And it cost me like 4.9 mil or like 5 mil. So yeah, now I'm only on uh, 5.9 mil. So I was on 10 mil before I bought it. Alright. Oh, okay. I feel like every time you go on like a two or three day break and come back, I, I just come back and I'm like, oh, I spent like, you know, 25 mil. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you, like, you spend a lot of money when I'm away, man. Yeah, like I, I'm going through constant upgrades. I've been playing like at least like six or seven scav runs a day. So, I, thought, I thought you hate playing this game on your own. <laughs> yeah, I do, but scav runs are easy, because they only happen, like, once every 15 minutes. So I'll, like, watch the news, and I'll be like, oh, oh my scav timer's on, okay, do that. Go back to watch the news, and I'll like, watch the news as I'm playing the game. Basically what I'm doing is just, like, watch YouTube, or watch Twitch, or, like, talk to my friends while I'm playing the scav runs. I just have that kid every, like, 20 minutes to do my scav timer. Alright, I must admit, I need something similar. I hate doing TMC runs by myself, though. Like, I find this really annoying. Oh, I need to sell my stupid helmet. Oh, also, I got more uh, tier 5 armor while you were gone. So now I have, like, 7 sets of tier 5 armor in my hideout just sitting there doing nothing. Uh, that sounds cool. I mean, you can have some if you want. I, I just have so much of it. Yeah, I think I have five tier fives and two tier sixes now, I think. Something like that. Well, we should do something cool then with it, like, go for, like, a labs raid or something. I have, like, six labs cards, so... I'm not done the uh, labs properly yet. I've, I've never done labs either in my almost 700 hours of playing the game. Actually, how long have I played this game total? Let me check. Oh, I, oh, I was way off. I've only played for 540 hours. Wow, I thought you'd be playing longer than that. Same, actually. So I did almost 400 hours last wipe, so I've played like 160 hours in the past month. That's a lot. I like how my survival rate's only 41%, even though I swear to god, like, I survived significantly more raids than raids. This must not- okay, it probably isn't counting scav runs, that's probably why, it's only counting PMC runs. Never mind. I was gonna say, like, I've only survived 67 raids, are you fucking kidding me? Like, no way. I refuse to believe that. Yeah, I was looking at my stats earlier, and I could have sworn I sweated a little bit more when I did. Alright, let me know when you're ready. Uh, I'm just getting organized. There'll be a second. Yep, I'll be on uh, interchange 16. Cool. Also, by the way, uh, I read a comment on the YouTube just the other day that I was like, huh, let me try that. This seems like a smart idea, and it's worked pretty well for me. Uh, I don't know if you're still getting long waiting queues to get into the game or long queues to find games when you're playing by yourself, but someone said that uh, when you do the- you know how, like, you pick, like, the London servers or whatever to, yeah, yeah. like, go on at the start of the game? If you pick multiple servers that are, like, all, like, under 50 ping, you can find games, like, four times quicker. And that's been working for me as well. Like, I've been only- I've only found games in the past, like, five days, or since you've been gone, like, three, five days, under two minutes. I've got to get, like, a 30-minute load screen because I've tried I, that. I upped on today, there's no problem getting in whatsoever. I got in straight away. Right. If it's working for you, it's working for you, but... Figured I'd mention it. I kept getting those like long four to six minute wait times for all my runs, and I tried that, and it dropped down to like ninety seconds, two minutes. It's been really nice. Probably even one or two things. Less people are playing it now, which is good. Ah, uh, 
they've fixed something on Tarkov, which doesn't sound don't right to me. Yourself. Yeah, yeah, don't kid yourself. Yeah. You know, I doubt it. Uh, I, I mean, that last one was a long shot, but you never know. Ew! Why is my character rated like Toolless Sandal Crocs? Ew! What the fuck? Who the fuck wears Toolless Sandal Crocs into a war zone? What the fuck? Ew! This is so ugly! Oh no! Oh god, my scab is so ugly! Oh, it's so weird. I, oh, I didn't mean to cut you off, this is just fucking disgusting to look at, I hate this. Oh, I can't wait to see this scab, mate. Oh my god, why would you ever wear it? First off, why the fuck would you wear toeless anythings? But especially, why would you wear, like, sandal crocs with no toes on them? That's so weird. Dude, fucking ban this scab. This scab should be fucking banned. They're really loving that scaven. Look at those shoes! Oh my god, man. Who the fuck would ever wear those willingly? Of all the things this scab could have worn, why uh. the fuck would you wear that? You know what I don't hate though? Your amazing backpack. Ah, uh, you want it? Oh, no, you can have it, but like, you know, that's one of the best in the game, so. I know, I've got one already. I have, I think, five on me in my, my hideout. Does have them all inside of each other. Yeah, great backpacks. I still find it funny how you're allowed to do that. Just put like 20 backpacks and other backpacks and other backpacks. I don't think it works like that in real life, but uh... I think you could you know. potentially do it in real life. You could do maybe like two, three, or four, but not like five plus. No, no, you could you can do it to a step. These guys do it. Especially like backpacks that are like different sizes, where it's like you. I don't think you put like a backpack that's like has like six pockets all around it and like very wide, in like a backpack that goes down is like very vertically tall. You know, but that wouldn't work. So like, if you look at some of the backpack designs in the menu, like, you know where you're gonna put, fit, like, a... Like a mechanical on a switchblade. It's just, it's just not gonna happen, it's too thick. That's just cut off the music on stream. Ow! No one man should have all that power. I don't know why I'm singing fucking... Kanye West, but you know. Oh yeah, Kanye West fan. Oh, I'm I am I am I am not at all. Uh, I like maybe three of his songs total, maybe four out of his like twenty albums. More of an Eminem fan personally, if I have to pick a rapper. Yeah, I like Eminem. Oh, also, again, while you were gone, I've uh, expanded the uh, interchange loot path. I found more stuff. Ooh, cool. So there's uh, two uh, silver military boxes down um, in one of the parking garages that's by one of the exits, which I will be trying to loot more often now because they drop a gun I need for a quest. Mm. And I have also found a you know, place where you like park for up the boxes and to get the box on top of the shipping crates? Yeah. Out that door, there's also a weapon box in one of the shipping containers right to the left of that. So, yeah. That's cool. Yeah, I found more boxes, which is always good. Also, did you spawn in? Uh, it's the same synchronized with players at the moment. Alright, just checking, because I spawned outside, and I didn't know if you spawned inside or outside or not, so I'm just wondering. I wonder if it'll go slow again now. been proper lucky with me all week. Yeah, it's just that. Yep, it's it's just fully frozen now. Oh. Oh, there we go. I'm in. Okay, when you spawn inside like I worried about, alright, just stay there. I'll be running in in a second. Alright. Alright, I'm in. Cool. I am just taking some bolts out this way. Yo, you got a fucking dope ass key in your backpack. 
Oh yeah. That looks nice. Yeah, I don't see you, but you gotta be back here somewhere. Right. Do you see my Do you see my flashlight? Hmm. Oh, I know where you're at. Stay there. Yeah, you're right around this corner. You spawned really far away from me, by the way. Like that's really weird. Ah, it's super strange, is that? Like you should have you should have spawned like two rooms over. There's a dead body right here. Did you kill this guy? Nope, I've not killed anybody yet. Do you see my flashlight? Flash again. Turn around. Yeah, I see someone. Right. Yeah. I, no, like I'm I'm behind you. Turn around. Oh. Hey, buddy. There's a dead There's a dead body right here outside this door. Cool. Let's take it with stuff. <laughs> it's a player too, I think. Oh. I guess headphones. No, not a player. He just had really decent stuff on him for some reason. Heavy shotgun. Ooh, bolt cutter. I'll take the rig. It's pretty bad, but still better than mine. Mm. Is that you walking around? No, I'm stood still right here. There's a, there's a guy here. Right there. Yep, I see don't, him. Don't shoot. I think. Hi. Hey, yeah. Hey, yeah. Hey. You friendly? Friendly? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not going to shoot. Nice. Cool, where you at? That's, That's cool. cool. Are you a PMC, PMC or a SCAS? SCAS. Oh, oh alright. Alright, all right, see, right, see you, man. See you, man. See ya. I don't know if that's gonna be a PMC, so we use the uh, the scav camp XO for the XP. Yeah. Alright, you need flash drive still, so might as well take the PCs, right? Yeah, we spawned in early as well. Not like crazy early, but early enough, so. Might as well kill a little bit of time. PC there, oh, yeah. check it. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully, we get some cool stuff. Yeah, I'd put them out of the GPU. Nope. Absolute dog shit. Ooh, there's a tube here. I would take that. It sells for like 11k. Ooh. Well, we're not well. going to that PC room. Yeah. Please take that. There's a guy coming. I That's it. a scav. Yeah. Alright, well, we're going this way. Yeah, that sounds good to me. Wow, that was a horrible box. And there's a guy over here too. I don't know if that's a scab or not. Uh, which way are you talking? Why did you lose me when I was right next to you? I honestly don't know, mate. Oh, there you are. I've got you. Cheers. I, I, I get the sarcastic light thing. That's my favorite Kanye song. All of the lights. This is going to be a Kanye West inspired theme. Theme? Stream. Stream theme. Oh, emoter. I need that. Just no N in Paris, alright? <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't like that song. I got it's that. kind of wacky. Yo, chill. Guy's back here. You know, like, we're going the, there's so many people here, what the fuck? It's, it's kind of creeping me out, I mean, people are like, everywhere we go right now, like, they're following us. Ah, oh, that's just good old fashioned paranoia, is that, mate? I mean, it feels like that, doesn't it? Like, turn a corner, dude, turn a corner, dude, turn a corner, dude. And there's a guy over there, too! In that fucking store back there. I hear him. Yeah, that's creepy. And I lost you again. Fuck. Motherfucker, I'm in the store. What? I'm dead. No, hey, hey, hey! Hallway. Oh. 
Yeah, there's a guy in that store, like, on your left. Because I, I can hear him. Because I think they broke the game. Because my headphones are working, like, five times better than usual. Where, like, I can hear people walking on wood from, like, seven stores over. It's really weird. So, like, anytime I hear someone walk on wood or metal, like, I know they're there. Yo, T-plug, right here. You need that for your quest. I think I found a few things myself, to be fair. Oh, yeah, I need that for something. Alright, up we go. This must be right at the start or something today, because, uh... Yeah, we spawned in at 29 minutes on the clock, which isn't, like, crazy early, but it's early enough that, you know, people are still doing their stuff. Yeah. E drill, I would take that, right there. Oh, and drill. Oh, another E motor. I will take that. Yeah, no one came up here and looted these two stores, apparently. Broken LCD here. I would take that. Right there. Yep. 11k. Uh, two things right there. Uh, I wouldn't take the magazine. I'd take that little handrail. Okay. Alright, should be clear. Oh, no PCB, you need that for your quest as well, right? Right there? Yeah, I'm not that. And over here, check the little pharmacy back here. Empty. <gasps> Shit! Yeah, don't do that. That's where you need the one of the pharmacy keys for that door. Yeah. I was far trying to die. Uh, I really need a cancel button on that kick. Yeah, this should be one of the things like you could cancel the animation if you move or something. Alright, well, that guy definitely looted the store back here already, but... Also, about this store, I never noticed this, and I don't think other people really have either. Mm. A lot of good sh stuff can spawn on the, um, the side tables in this room. Like LCDs, like weapons, stuff like that. So I usually come in here and just get that little weapon box right there. It's already looted. But if you like check these tape, these little wall things right here, like look at that broken LCD. Ooh, and I get and I found like hand drills on here. I found like um like gold chains at one point. There's a dead body right there. All right, hold on. I I'm gonna sneak and like grab the arm. There's a guy. Yeah, there's a guy. I don't think he knows me. No, yeah, I think he's fine. Yo, what's up? Nah, scaven around, scaven looking around. for stuff. stuff. Okay, I think he's probably not an asshole, but... You know. Yeah. So I thought he was a PMC with the gear he had, and I saw he had, like, a fucking beret on. I was like, no, no PMC's gonna come to a raid with a fucking beret. No. Unless you're really nuts. Okay, coming. Okay. He's out, he's the way we came in. I have no idea if that's a scab or not. Like a player scab or a normal scab? Nope. Definitely creepy though. Agreed. Uh, come here. Yep. Take this. You have a lot more space than me, so I'm gonna give you a couple things. Yeah, even I don't have space for that. Uh, let me move some stuff out. Uh, I would drop two of those magazines in your tactical rig. Because they're bad. Got that. I'll just got that. I'll just got that. Cool. And let's be all that up. Now I can take motor and heal it. Yeah, I would, just, I, would just, I would just move those all three LCDs into your rig to free up space. Uh, what was that? 
So I'll just move all three of those LCDs into your rig up top. That way they take up less space in your actual backpack. Oh yeah, that makes good sense. Cool. Get a little bit better now. Oh, I also found you a gift, by the way. Oh, that's nice. Uh, I had to do it on the TMC, but, um... So I found out some lore the other day that I never thought about, but, like, once I heard about it, I'm like, oh, shit, this makes a lot of sense. So right. you're stuck on Gunsmith Part 4, right? Yeah. Just like me. I was stuck on that, too. Then I read a YouTube comment that was... Because you can tell I was watching some Tarkov videos recently. Yeah. And in the comment, he was like, well, if you go to Mechanic, or, uh, I think it's Mechanic, if you do a barter with him, he gives you an M4A1 that has the magazine in the thing. So, like, you can just trade him for the gun that has the parts in it, and then turn that in with a couple of alterations. And I bought that gun, and I was like, you know, okay, I did my quest. And I was going to tell you about it, I was going to buy you the gun and give it to you. But guess what I found on my very next raid? What's that? The fucking, the part for the gun that you can't get anymore, that you need for your quest. Right. I just found it. So now I'm going to give it to you, and then you're going to do the quest, and get it done. Ah, oh, sweet. Yeah, so now you get Gunsmith Part 4 done, and then you're going to be stuck on, I think... And they can do 5 immediately, I believe, and 6 is the one you're going to be stuck on again, like me. But they should maybe level you up, just two of those quests knocked out. That would be really nice, actually. Yeah, you're getting close to the flea market, so hopefully we can get this sorted for you. I think you had a scav. Yeah. Alright, let's go. I only come in here for the uh, medical box over here. I stopped looting the normal ones. Ah, uh, I just found some stuff on the shelves occasionally. I, I mean, just I, found a cheese. You know, like you'll, you'll find stuff, but it's never stuff really worth the time. Mm. Like, because this box right here, over here, that I loot, you can tell by the color of the box how it's like this like big uh, orangey color. That's yeah. like the like the elite medical boxes. They right. drop like the best medicals. I thought it was one of those. And Oh, is that another one? No, nah, there's um two like sports bags and then there's that one. Oh, right. jacket. Yeah, sports bag. That's what I'm thinking of. All right, let's go and do a Bitcoin locker. Loot the silver chest, and then... You don't have that much space left, right? Um, no, I don't. No, I've got like... Six plus spots left, nine. I only got four. So we'll double back and get those two uh, other silver boxes uh, under the parking garage as well. Cool. Because normally I wouldn't care. Like, if I, was, if I spawned by my grab, but I wouldn't really worry about it otherwise. But they apparently can spawn the uh, gun that I needed for Gunsmith 6 in them. So... Might as well check them just in case they actually drop the gun I need. Any good b other good bits of lava that you know about? Um, not particularly. Just you know those two or three, which I you know I think are pretty good. Oh, Nothing. That's unfortunate. Found some cigarettes, that's about it. You can get that box behind the counter, I'll get the silver box down here. Cool. Um, yeah, okay, I found something for you. Oh, cool. I found two things for you, actually. Just hop over that railing and come down here. Okay, first off, throw your hat off. I found you a tier 3 helmet. And then open that, and there's a little pistol in there you can take. A decent one, too.
Actually, there's one more piece of lore I can tell you about, but it's not, like, that important anymore at this part, point in the light. Okay. So, uh, down, down there, these, there's, like, I'll point them out, like, these shelves, like, right here, they can spawn stuff on them, which you probably already knew. But yeah. I've been finding, like, a lot of really good shit on these shelves back here. Like, thermite and, uh, like, purple bolt cutters and stuff. Like, you know, 50 to 80k worth of stuff each time I go back here. So, like, right here. That sells for, like, 30k, I think, right there, if you can take that. Oh, I can get rid of something to get that in. I got rid of a PC card, I think. Yeah, it's fine. Oh! And then, like, yeah, and then this is the shelves back here. Where they can drop like thermite or that little sewing kit which i'll take those aren't bad so yeah if you ever come through here i'd recommend checking these because they can spawn uh pretty decent stuff on them that you wouldn't really expect there to be on these and there's also a couple back here as well like right there and they sit here empty okay that's pretty decent to know yeah, and also, we're filled up. I'm not even gonna bother looting those weapon boxes because I don't want to waste our time. But I'll show you the other box I found. They're right in this little tractor trailer in front of us. If you park for in this, there's a weapon box. I see it. And I'm gonna run past it, I think, to get down the thing. Yep. You just jump in, and you got about. Someone already got it, but there's a box right back there. Alright. Yeah, I see it. Yep. And now he's good at the exit. Well, obviously they worked out pretty well. Yeah, I'm happy with this one. Um, before we go, uh, mm -hmm. make two spaces, and I'll give you uh, this to sell. Uh, don't think I need the hemorrhage at the moment, so I've got rid of that. I put it right there. There we go. Cool. I should sell for, I think, at least like 40k. Oh, now the game gives me a better rig. <laughs> Sounds alright. I mean, I'll take it. Ooh, some nice XP there. Oh yeah. You got a ton of shit, so. Why do it that way? Why don't I just make room and take the backpack off when I put the backpack in? Was 
because it's a big, big ass backpack and it's hard to get yeah. in. Yeah, and we'll just throw away that shitty day pack, the small one. And then drive the backpack in. Right, I'll get rid of a day pack, that makes sense. Yeah, if you already got so many better options, you know, get away the small stuff. Okay. Uh, yeah. Cool. There we go. I think I'm actually able to turn in that quest. I'm just going to check. D plug now. I hope so. That'd be nice. But I can actually remember who gave it to me. Mechanic. Mechanic, okay. Yeah, mechanic always wants like the parts and stuff, usually. Alright, I need two more T plugs. Alright, go to your hideout, and in your workshop, there's like a thing that you can turn in the T-plugs, I think. Maybe. If you can do that, then I'll do that for you, otherwise we'll just, you know, find it the old-fashioned way. Mm. Yep, you can turn a uh, power cord and nails into one T-plug. Takes an hour, though. Oh, I'm sure we can. Oh, I need some nails. I've got a PC oh. card in. That's not it. Alright. So, yeah, you keep an eye for T plug, you keep an eye for nails. That'll help. Cool. Alright, well, now the question is what map do you want to play? Um, good question. Well, let me look at my quests. Let's see what we've got. Woods. I wouldn't mind doing this one on customs. Okay, you gotta obtain folder zero zero three one. Okay. Um which one even is that? Hold up. I thought we did that one together already. I thought we did as well. Unless... Arcana, bad rep evidence. I thought that was when we had to run in the factory and then, like, plant shit. Mm. I remember doing it, but it's come back. Unlock the portable cabin one. on customs where the file is located. What the fuck are you even talking about, game? Where the fuck? What? I'm so confused. Apparently I, I did this quest. I don't even fucking remember doing this. Okay, um... So where is this thing at? By the factory shack. What? According to who? I'm actually really confused. Like, apparently I, I did this, like, ages ago. But, like... Okay, uh, okay. Is that, is that one way you had to run into my little shack thing, just on customs? It's uh, that, but it's a different shack. You remember where the tanker with, with the watch is, right? Yeah. It's right in that, it's that area. There's, like, a like a metal shack of stairs. You gotta run up the stairs and go in that shack and grab the thing. 
I, and you, get, you, you need the portable bunkhouse key. I, I don't know if I have that key or not. I'll check, but I have the trailer park portable key, which is a different key. Mm. Um, speaking of keys, uh, check out how much money your key is worth. The good one you have. Oh yeah, that's a good point. You see how much it sells for in the flea market. Ooh, three one five hundred. Yeah, that's only for the trader. We'll it on the flea market, though. I haven't got a flea market yet, have I? Yeah, but you can still check the price. I think just go in your inventory, click on it, and then um. All right. Uh, filter by can... filter by item on it, and that should take you to the flea market, and you can maybe see the price of it. Otherwise, I'll look it up. I don't think it lets me just yet. All right. What's the name of the key? RB dash simp key. <laughs> dash simp? Uh, SMP. S oh, almost. Almost, oh, mate. Oh my almost. God. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh. This is worth 900k. Jesus. 900k for it? Yeah, the lowest one is 867,000 for this key. That sounds nice. <laughs> like I said, that what I saw was a reserve key, I was like, that's gonna be a fucking good key. Right, we're keeping that one. Mm. Goddamn right we are. I like how I'm saying we like it's my key. Yeah. Like I, like I somehow earned it. Oh, do you want this uh emo back then? No, you can just sell all that stuff. Oh cool. You need the money more than I do, so. And I think I have the exact two that I need for the uh, hideout when I do need to get the, get that done. Take that piece of shit off. Man, you gotta sell some dog shit to have actual room in your inventory. I know. Like, please just sell like all those horrible magazines and then just buy them back as needed. All right, let's do that. Cause like, when are you ever going to need that many magazines? You say that, and then I'm gonna need the magazines. Then you just buy them back from Mechanic for like 10% more than you sold them for. Alright. Get clicky, madman. Yeah, the only ones I wouldn't sell are the ones that are like half black and half brown, because those are for the scar. Yeah, but I've got a scar. You do have a scar. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I wouldn't sell those ones. And before I forget, I'll bring you the, uh, the P-Mag. As it's so gracefully- What? I can't put- I can't put the P-Mag in my fucking safe pouch? Are you fucking kidding me? Interesting. Okay, well, let's start with an interchange run then. That way I can bring you this P-Mag and hopefully we can survive with it. Cool. Alright. Okay, that's the game plan now. Cabin key for that quest. Oh, and it's being sold for like negative $12. Alright, I can buy one of these for you. That's easy. I'll give you one of these as well.
Also, go to Ragman, and when you look at your headsets, sell the ones to him that have the um, the microphone attached to it. The they look like gaming headsets. That's take Yeah, sell, yeah the, there's two that look like gaming headsets. Sell those. Those are worse than the other ones you have. Okay. Yeah, those are like the, um, like the C tier that you can get. Yeah, hopefully now you have uh, less space problems. Which I still find hilarious, by the way, that you have the pay to version of the game but still have space problems. I know, I'm a little hard. Like, you have, you know, still like next year, you know, 50 slots compared to me, or 60 or 70, and I'm still making good on what I have. It's wild. Like I said, I'm a good hoarder. Yeah, I'm a hoarder too. Like, why do you think I got fucking nine sets of armor in my inventory right now? And also, eight bottles of whiskey. <laughs> like, I'm a hoarder as well, it's just... I hoard properly. Nah, I, do, I do it in the old-fashioned way, which is just to keep everything. Which isn't good. I'll admit that. Oh no, did I sell the magazine? Oh shit. Oh no, I may have made a tactical blunder. But I sold my magazine. So I can't buy that back. Certainly must be found in raid for the farming part two quest. Oh, fuck, oh. I did. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, hold on, maybe someone's selling another one. No, oh, it's gonna be really- Dude, if we get into a firefight, we're gonna get our asses blown out, by the way. So you better hope it doesn't happen. So I'm, I'm bringing a quest gun, not a PvP gun. You bring a quest gun? Yes. Uh, I'm gonna get out as a shot. Be fun, right? I mean, if you, more- Oh, I mean, it's interchange. We usually don't find people on interchange where we do the caches, but... Yeah. Just if we do see a guy, I'm bringing my scopeless sniper rifle, so... You know, um, and also if I fire five times, I gotta take the magazine out and then reload the magazine every five shots. So, we're not gonna be in a good spot if we get into a firefight. Just, you know, your fair warning. Okay. I guess I could bring two guns, but I, you know. I don't know about that one. Let me get a slightly better gun in that case. Because I'm okay with a shotgun, but I don't think I'd run a blue risk with a lance on it. Yeah, I would agree. And also grab a backpack. Yep. Let's go for that one. Probably sell that stuff at the bottom of the mechanic as well. Except the cigarettes, put the cigarettes in your scat box. Okay. I think I need that pipe for something, but I don't want a drill. But I'm not sure about the ratchet, but the bolts I can keep as well. Uh, I don't think you need the ratchet for anything. If you do, then you can just find another one. Or buy and leave the flea market. Alright, let me sell that one then. Because the ratchet looks like the, the other things that you need, which I think is a problem. It looks the right. same thing as like the bolt cutters and stuff. Yeah, some stuff is weird. Like you don't know, I don't know why a therapist needs a mechanical drill, but you know. Clearly, she really wants it for something. Uh, what about the silicon tube? Anything? I would sell all that to her except the cigarettes. Alright. Alright, let me get a decent gun. Oh, let me sell the gun first, actually. I'm gonna sell that. 
power. Yeah, that's a pretty bad gun, so yeah, I'd sell that. Right, what map? Uh, interchange. Inter yeah, interchange. Give me a second to test out my gun. Just want to make right. sure that the um, the red dot works. Oh, oh probably the I put the gun on my character. Oh, cool. Let's try that again. Okay, yeah, it works. Alright, uh, interchange 21. I could have looked too bad. Yeah, I just hope I can snipe a scav from 40 meters away in the darkness. Five times. No pressure. Yeah, it should be pretty easy. actual armor just in case you know they do start shooting me in the distance they'll like totally don't get shot in the eyeball or something like that yeah that's the worst way to go really Ow. yeah i'll pass you the magazine and the um the key as well over here once i find a box So Liverpool was fun. Was it now? What'd you do? Um, went to a christening and got drunk. 
That sounds fairly British, yeah. <laughs> I mean, all I've done is, uh, I don't know, not play Mass Effect, really. I took the last two days off. I heard German was done Mass Effect 3, though. I only got, I think, uh, like 10 or 12 hours left. Dude, my last stream was wild. I did the fucking DLC, and, like, I'm still not sure if I hate that DLC or not, or whether I love it. Because it was fucking ridiculous. I assume that the DLC, at least. It felt like a DLC. What was it? Sorry? Was the it when he got. It's where Anderson gives you, like, his apartment building, and you have, like, shore leave. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, with Clone Shepard. That's DLC, yeah. That DLC was awful, but also really funny. I'm not I, sure whether I hated it or not. I, I kind of enjoyed that. I, I, I thought it's like, pretty funny. Okay, it's one of those things where, like, I'm playing Mass Effect for it to be serious, because, like, it's a serious game. So, I'd like, so the comedy was kind of off-putting at first, so I was like, the more it went on, I was like, this is so fucking stupid, that I kind of fucking love it. I don't know, uh, with the end, you know, that, it's kind of nice, it's nice to have a bit of a, uh, bit of levity. And also, uh, you missed, like, a really good bit at the end of my last stream, where, um, mm -hmm. I'll just go this way. Where I got raided by one of my, like, friend's friends, so was, I wouldn't call him my friend, but, like, I know him, so whatever. And, uh, I tried to cheat on uh, my girlfriend, Pally, like, four times. They got friendzoned every time by the, by the other characters, and it was really funny. Because it was like, I was like, where the fuck is Tally at? I don't even know where she's at, man. I can't find her. She's really stupid. And I was like, dude, fuck it. I'll, I'll even fuck Liara at this point. Try to fuck Liara. She comes up to a friend zone, and I'm like, oh, shit. All right, well, fuck it, dude. I'll call up fucking uh, James. James, you want to fuck me? Does nothing. Okay, we'll talk to Garrus. What about you, Garrus? I'll call you up to my apartment. What do you, what do you got for me, buddy? Friend zone me. Nothing. And then I called up Trainer. I was like, Trainer, you want to have sex with me? He's like, no, nah, bless me. Get out of here. And it was just God. all the characters running down the list of who's gonna friend zone me. It was horrible. Oh my god. Speaking of horrible. Yeah. Not that way. Yeah, that's like, next mission, who did I find? Pally. And I was like, ah, oh, shit. Alright, guys, don't snitch. Don't snitch. It's not cheating if I failed. It became like a whole bit for the end of my, like, hour, hour of my stream. I'd be trying to cheat on Pally and being a bad boyfriend. So, did you actually good. manage to see a video of Tally then, or...? Uh, I mean, she talked to me and she was like... I asked her, I was like, hey, you know, we dated in that last game, is it gonna make your job awkward now that you're like a captain of your ship? She's like, uh, a little bit, you know, we don't gotta be super open about it, but I still love you, you know, we're, we're still dating. So, I, I assume that means we're still dating. Alright. So, did you hook up at the party then? Did I do what? You can hook up with some at yeah, the party. Uh, I think I got friends in. Uh, yeah, I didn't get I didn't get laid. Uh, yeah, I think I've seen a bit where you can actually get laid in the game. Mm. But DLC. Here's the thing. I did. I did, see. I did the party without Tally. So, uh, right. Because I didn't have her in the party. By that point, so I did the guest stuff like right after I did the party. So I didn't know it was a DLC when I started it. Also, eyes open, this is where the scabs are at, so, you know, if you see any scabs, let me know. I don't hear any rushing yet. I see one, I think. No, they, I think it's part of the crane, never mind. He is part of the crane. I miss the Christmas tree. Honestly, I agree. It was nice. And we have we have Ember Commons for Xfil, so we're gonna go around the entire outside of the map as is. So, all right. We should see some of the power station probably, because we're gonna end up going past that at some point. Ooh, that wasn't bad. Did you guys have a flashlight on it? No. Uh, take this and see if you can put this flashlight on your gun then. 
right there. I thought it for a second. I, yeah, it's like right, right there. Right where my gun is pointing. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see if you can put that in your AK. No, it won't let me. Alright, well, fair enough. They're having fun in there. Yeah, it sounds like they're tr trying to fight with parrots and ants or something. Ooh. <laughs> wow. That's pretty decent. Actually, can I put that in my safe pouch? Yeah, I can. What's it? Uh, Moonshine. Ooh! Sells for 80k. Open this and take both of those. Put that key in your safe pouch. Got both. Well, I don't care about the nails, but keep the key in your safe pouch for your quest. Well, I'm keeping the nails as well, just in case after all this stuff. Alright. You know, if we come across anything better, I'll take it. But, you know, now. Yep, yep. You can have this cash. Cool. Ooh. Yep. Decent pair of headphones. Yeah, it's pretty decent. Yeah, I think those are sword ends. They're not bad. Yeah. Tend to be what I use. Yeah, the next one. Cool. Ooh. That looks cool. What is it? I would throw that away then. They sell really terribly. Really? Yeah, they sell for like 5k to Ragman. Oh. They're just gimmicks. I'll just sell it anyway it's, if I don't get anything. Yeah, but y y you will. We're gonna loot like 10 more caches, so. Oh, so I probably will. Okay, that's gonna be decent. Yeah, we're gonna go around the entire map, so. Oh, should be fun. Definitely should think we'll fun. get scuffed by the power station. I hope I get like three. I mean, the problem is, if they go in the station, we're kind of fucked. There's no way I'm gonna get a 40 meter shot on someone in the power station. No. There's usually one in the cat pack. You know, another problem is, is that I'm American, so like, I don't, I don't, we don't use meters. So like, I'm not even used to calculating meters, like in my head. Oh, you know? yeah, yeah. It yeah, might well, be extra tough for you then. Yeah. No, but I can't I've... do it off the top of my head or anything. Yeah, but like, you know, at least you like know what a meter looks like. I don't. I don't know how many feet or inches a meter is. something. Nice. Bottle of what? 
uh, it's like that little medical thing, Nakal or something. Nakal. Oh, Nakal, yeah, yeah, yeah. You need that to upgrade your uh, med station, right? I think so, yeah. He was just bottle, like make a bottle like whiskey or moonshine or something. Oh, I thought it was at first. It would look shiny. Now I get the cash, I'll get the weapon box. Cool. Trump coffee? Uh, it's Doctor Lou post coffee. Oh. Yeah, close enough. Yeah, that's pretty good. So it's like twenty-five k, something like that. I can see it's in the corner. I find red, these fucking lasers terrifying. Like, look at that. If you if you see this shit, it's gonna intimidate you. But I thought I saw something funny on the ground. <laughs> it's fucking very spooky. Yeah. What do you think of the uh, Predator? Never seen those movies though. But ah. Uh. I mean, I don't think I'm missing out to be honest. The first one's enjoyable. Never seen Alien either. I there recommend the first one. Everyone does, yeah. You know how it is. It's not anime, it's really hard to get me into it. Mm. Although I am watching season 2 of The Witcher right now. What do you think? Uh, I think it's significantly better than season 1 so far. Oh, good old fashioned cash. Uh, let me. Wow, that was sounded like an explosion. Yeah, grenade. Alright, get the weapon box in the uh, dumpster here. Cool. Hey, did you watch season one of The Witcher? I watched season one. Hmm. Did you like it? I thought it was okay. Yeah, as someone who's a fan of Witcher 3 and has read some of the books, I thought it was okay, but not anything better than okay. Yeah, I'd, I'd agree with that. I think Season 2 has been noticeably better, although they, they retconned something really, really weird. Like, ex like strangely weird. What did you played Witcher, you, you played Witcher 3, right? Yeah, I played all 3. Yeah, they fucking killed Eskel in the show. Really? And they, and they rewrote his, they made Eskel Lambert. Where, like, his whole character is, like, an asshole in the show. And he's, like, bullying Siri and, like, trying to make her, like, kill herself and be an asshole. And then he, uh, dies. And they, like, feed his body to the wolves. Guy, on the road. Crouch. Fall back. I don't know if that was a scav or a player, but... If it's a player, he's probably gonna come towards us. Then. Have you still got an eye on him? I don't. I'm gonna move into this car in front of us so I can start trying to peek in the road. Okay. I'm gonna move to where you are. Okay. Press the right fucking key. He's not on the road anymore. Cap, do you reckon that? Well, it's either he is a player who went into the parking garage and like went into the power station, or it's a scab who's out in the open and then ran back in. Oh, I see him. He ran to the substation. I think it's, uh, yeah, I think it is a scab. Okay. There's another guy here, I think. I think I heard a guy tiptoeing in that fucking parking garage. That wouldn't surprise me. 
systems, I think they broke the audio because, like, I swear to God, I hear, like, people's small movements from really far away now. And before, that wasn't the case. Also, no one's been here yet, by the way, because the power is still not turned on. I still don't see many people have a key card yet. Yeah, but you need the power on to use, even use the normal keys on this map. A lot oh, of them. Oh, right. Could you need the power on to be able to open, like, the Kiba store for the gun store and, like, yes, yeah, okay, I saw the guy in the back. But yeah, you need key uh, power on for, like, 80% of the locked rooms. It's just a medical tent that you don't need the power on for, usually. Is that you on the metal? No, it's me behind it. Okay, well, someone has stepped on metal then. Which I assume is in the power... I think someone might be on the railing in the power uh, power station. Like, like the wooden or the metal walkway. Like, I'm, I'm trying to, like, make out a guy. I see him. Ah, fuck. He went inside. Alright, hold on. Where are you? Right next oh. to you. You tend to get lost fairly easily, so. I know, but I'm not that bad. Right, I'm on the left side of a truck. I see him. Yeah, hold on. Oh, nope. Oh my god, he's on the ceiling. He has me dead. Don't kill him, just fall back. Right, I'm back at the power station. Yeah, I have the same. Dude, he fucking fucked me up something fierce. Holy shit. I'm almost dead. Is that you in there? Yeah, I'm healing. Cool. Alright, moving back up. Cool. Oh my god, there's two of them now. Alright, fall back. Okay, falling back. Yeah, I'm like, right where you were, kind of. I'm reloading. I, I hate that I have to reload the gun manually, bullet by bullet. Man, I just can't see shit, man. Like, I really can't see anything right now. I mean, I hear them yelling. Yeah, I hear them yelling. I'll keep my arm back this, this way just in case I decide to go. Oh my god, man. How's I'm on 40 HP right now. We have we have to go. Like I I'm gonna die if we fucking Okay. Oh, I have heavy bleeding. Can you pass me a Salela? Yep. I've also got an M smack if you want that. Okay, yeah, drop that then. Alright, come over here. Yeah, like uh uh I'm in, I'm in a really bad spot. Hey, have we got it? It's by your foot? Yes. I see, I see it. I can't. There we go. Oh, no, they're coming. Alright, you're in charge of killing that guy. Okay. Like, I, I, I can't do it. 
Alright, all your stuff is insured, right? Uh, yeah. The gun and I think the helmet is and the backpack. I'll do what I can. <laughs> I think I might just take your backpack, to be honest. Go for it. It's a bigger backpack. Are you still bleeding? No. I'm on 90 HP with two broken legs, though. Shit. I had a splint as well. I could have given you that. Yeah, but I mean, like, broken, broken. Like, I got a CMS uh -oh. from I think I might die in a second. I think I hear another guy walking up on me. Right, so it is. I got nails, some cash, and the coffee thing. Oh, is your helmet insured? I think so. Alright. I'm taking the helmets. I'm dropping the AK. Taking your AK instead of the scavs AK. See, this is why it's bad to keep your medical supplies in your gamma pouch, because I could have really used those medical supplies if he died. Yeah, but if I lose my medical supplies, and... Oh no, you're gonna lose 11k in medical supplies, oh no. If only there was a doctor who would sell you them back immediately. Yeah, I'm just gonna say it, this fucking quest sucks. Yeah, I agree with you on that one. It's really annoying. I'm kind of shocked that I'm not being shot at right now. Oh, I'm on six water, too. Fantastic. That makes things so much easier. If I run, am I... No, okay. Good. Alright, I hid your stuff in a bush. Go. Cool. 
Oh, man. I wish this game had an alliance system where like I had like an MMO or not MMO but like a like a story element where like I could like side with a certain trader over the other ones and like kill the one I don't like so I can murder fucking Jaeger. Yeah, I get what you mean. Whereas like say I like really like, you know, mechanic and like therapist, like make an alliance between those two and then like help them take over Tarkov and stuff. Mm. That way I can get rid of fucking scumbag Jaeger and fucking prep or What I just find crazy is that, like, those scads are shooting me from the same distance I was firing that, and they were hitting me at perfect accuracy. And I'm wearing tier 5 armor, and they were still going like, through my tier 5 armor. Yeah, I mean, is... you're wearing pretty decent stuff. Yeah, I'm wearing a tier 4 helmet with a tier 3, sh 3 sh face shield and tier 5 armor, and it was just going through it anyway. I mean, the scavs, I shouldn't have that much decent stuff on them. Yeah. And the fact that I hit that scab like three times with this gun and it didn't just fucking die, it's just wild to me. Yeah. Like you would think that even if it's only in the chest, three like sniper shots with the fucking chest would kill you. I totally agree. <clears throat> All great. Now my fucking legs are broke again and both my arms are broken and I have a fracture and I'm heavy bleeding and I'm coughing. And whenever, whenever I run, I lose HP. Shit. God, I think it was fine. I just found a bush to die in. Now I'm at the X floor now. Oh, that's something at least. Just make sure you don't die at the X floor. I survived as I was dehydrating and getting the, like the fucking brain tumor. Ah. Uh, lucky at least. It could have gone a lot worse. Oh, it just makes me mad. Okay. Now I gotta find some fucking water to drink. Your scab timer up. Imagine it's probably ready. If so, we can do a scab run. Let's go for it. Interchange. Yeah. Twelve. Uh, probably yeah. Cool. Yeah, definitely yeah. Let me know when you're ready. Yeah, it's got to sell my shit. Take me a minute. That's okay. Right, I'm in. Cool. Oh, 
the emptiest lobby I've ever seen. Matching Yay. hats. Yay! Nice. We got a uh, matching bomber hats. I'm gonna call them condom hats. <laughs> Hell yeah. I mean, I find Bomber had to be a stupid name for him anyway. Yeah. They pretty, look pretty stupid hats anyway, in general. I agree. I mean, realistically, why would he wear something like that? I mean, my guy's wearing it over his fucking ski mask like a fucking goober, so... What's that say about him? Mm. Slightly worse than me, I suppose. You know what I find really nice? What after I hit uh one one point zero zero uh scav karma, mm -hmm. I started spawning with tier four armor like every other raid as a scav. That's pretty decent. Yeah, I think I think I've been good. Guns as a scav as well. Yeah, the your scav rep, the better chance you have of spawning with guns with uh, more stuff on them or mm -hmm. better tier guns. I mean, you gotta think. He just spawned, he did spawn off a scav that had a 900k key on his in his back pocket, so. Yeah. Not the worst thing to have in your back pocket, really, is it? <laughs> I think it's the best thing I've ever seen on a scav. Yeah. So. I mean, the best I ever had, I think I spawned with, like, um, like a key that's worth, like, 580k on a scav. He spawned in early. Which I had a feeling that was going to happen. Away in my end. Uh, yeah, I know. I just crash out. Have a look for it, Jesus. No, uh, you're in. Oh, yeah. Right, are you just next to me? Or? Yeah, I'm, uh, yeah I'm, right, I'm right near. Who are you talking Nice go. Now it's a scab right there. In that doorway. Alright. Yeah, this is where these uh, boxes are. You come out here, and you see these like green army tents. Yep. There's two in these tents. You just go in here, you can take this one. It's right there. At the end of that, and I'll get the one in this one over here. Ooh. These are like the best medical, or the best, best uh, military boxes you can get. These silver ones. Oh, a filter. Nice. Found a full durability adder on mine. Right. I have seven something. You have what? I got a five seven. Look like a cheap. Uh, yeah, that's not that big of a deal then. Nah, I didn't think it was. My favorite part, walking on these loud ass escalators. They are so chuffing loud. Alright, well, we're early in the raid, so you know what we're gonna do. PC rooms? Yep. Dude, look at the scav. He has such a good backpack. Now, speaking of scavs. Yep, nice. Did one just there? Uh, armor on this guy if you want it. Bad armor, but. Yeah, it's better than no armor. Yeah. Yeah, an eye pack on him. That's not bad. I'll take a dumb helmet, I suppose. Right. Yeah. The 
fuck? That scab just wiggled at me. Yeah, I'm not, you know what? I've never seen a scab do that. Really? Like a real, like, a, like an AI scab. I only see player scabs doing that. Alright, start tracking them. Oh, someone already got these. Uh, come here, T-plug, right here. Where, where? Right there on that table. That table? Right here. Right, right, right here. Uh, that's just what I needed in life. Someone running. Yeah, I think it's probably a scav. I almost shot that fucking washing machine or the fuck that is. I thought it was a fucking dude crouched. It does look a bit like a dude crouched, to be fair. It's, oh, God. Fuck that thing. You know the drill, close the door behind you. Yep. This one too? Yep. Alright, they're all done. Yeah. Oh, it's a military box right here. Oh, what do you find? Yeah, never noticed that. Oh, I found some weapon parts down here as well. It's not bad, let's go. Um, hop over that railing and check the Bitcoin lockers and get that weapon box, and I'll get the uh, gray box over here. Now I got it while you're doing the blockers. Yeah, I almost shot you because I didn't realize you were there. Oh, I'm glad you hesitated. I Means you have good trigger discipline. Someone already came through here, so I'm skipping this. Uh, get that weapon box.
couldn't tell that was in front of me, was that behind us? Uh, it's outside, I think. Ah, uh, makes an eye change. Yeah, because those shots are very, uh, deafened. So I assume they're outside. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this guy's wearing tier 4 armor. Uh, like an armored rig. I would take this. Oh, yeah. Uh, the, if it's the beanie you're wearing, yeah, it is. It's purple. So it sells for a decent bit. It's like 28k or something. Come on. Oh, I need to just get up. There we go. Don't, don't move, don't move, don't move. Don't move? The people, the people by the PC room over there, they're running. Don't know if they're players, just guess. Okay. Alright, pop up. He walked towards us, I think it's an AI scab, just chilling. Mm. Yeah, okay. Right Yo, what's up? Yeah, I saw you in the distance, I didn't know if you were a player or not, so I was kind of standing still. Yeah, I, yeah, when I saw the hat, I knew that, but I couldn't tell from the distance. Alright, let's go. Yep. Yeah. Good eye on me. I saw that guy from like six aisles away. Just saw his head poking out. I think he was wearing like one of those uh, tier three uh, UN helmets. Oh, those things stand out like a mile. Yep. Hmm, my shrimp's leveled up. Uh, cigarettes here. I would take this for your eventual cigarette quest. On that uh, table. On that table. Uh, cool. Someone's already been through here. They already checked the PCs. Uh, they didn't take the shit on the tables, though. Uh, they weren't being that thorough. Alright, come here. I have more cigarettes for you. Right there. On the ground. Uh, let's get rid of my bandage, because I don't need that. You have an uh, eight pack anyway if you get bleeding. Cool. Oh. Right, I assume they got one, they probably got them all, but just in case, so I'll just get in this next room. Um, yep, they already got these. Let's go. Cool. No need to dilly dally. They already got that locker as well, so we're going this way. They were very- they were annoyingly thorough. I'll give them that. Most people don't loot these PC rooms. Okay, which one did you just- <clears throat> I- you're right on top of me. <coughs> oh, I just need some water. Uh. They got these two, because of course they did. So someone had the same idea that we had, I'm guessing. Yeah. Missed the weapon box, though. I left the graphics cards. That would be really funny. Uh, I just found a purple... Weapon part? I've never seen that before. I have no idea. I found like a purple AK barrel. Are you coming? Oh, I thought you. Yeah, I'm coming. Yeah, I mean, I took it. I'm just saying, I've never seen a weapon part that wasn't just like the normal color. It's purple. Just not sure why. Hmm, I wonder how much you care, sir. I don't, exactly. They got these two, because of course they did. Oh, man. Oh, 
first go, sir. Oh, my sister's fur is aware. It didn't fill yeah, me with these... confidence that the doors were open. No, but these doors start open, though, oh. for a lot of these back rooms. Why, why are you in the room when they're looted? Good question. We're going to Texo, Tecolay, try to find your T-plug, then we're going to go to the filing cabinets. But we found the T-plug. Yep. I, I think I only needed one. No, you did too. Oh, did I? No. Yep. See, I like how I know your quest better than you know your quest. Yeah. I think it's because yes. I've got a memory of a goldfish, which doesn't make sense well. Yeah, I, I got that impression when you lose me every 13 seconds. I've gotten better. I'll give me that much. I mean, have you? <laughs> you still lose me every time I turn a corner. I see some dude left a graphics card in here for us. Here's not. Uh, you drill here if you have the room for it. Otherwise, I'll take it. Uh, what elf are you looking at? Right, right, right here. Ah. The four piece, sir. No, I don't have room if you want to have it. Yep. How much space do you have? Dulch, but I've got stuff I don't mind keeping up. Alright. Down we go. Okay, let's walk around. Back down the escalator, I take it. Mm hmm. I find a T plug on the uh, tables here. Terrible. I'll check the other side. Empty. Uh, and we're already like looted up, so I'm not even gonna bother checking the weapon crates because why would I? Yeah. I I already said I checked this. All right. See if you can hit those filing cabinets. If that guy fucking looted our filing cabinets, I'm gonna be absolutely upset. Oh, okay, like that, he will that, be. That's, that's gonna be too far on them. That is yeah, definitely gonna be the first thing that's gonna push you. That's here the shit out of me, by the way, hitting that fucking barbed wire. Yeah, didn't mean to run into it. Okay, they look unlooted, but... You can never know. Yo, take this F-Con, make room for this, for sure. Right there, that F-Con. I need four of those for a quest later on, and they also sell for like 40k, just normally. Got it. T-plug, in this one. T-plug in that one? Yeah, the, the bottom top, like the second one from the top. Sweet, let's get rid of that then. I'm happy. Oh yeah. Another T plug in this one. Another T plug in that one. Oh my god, we're finding all the T plugs now. Uh, I found a key for the director's thing. Ah, uh, who cares? It's a bad key. Oh, I'm still gonna discard that and 
get that. Yeah, I wouldn't pick that. It's not that good. Like better run up than what I chucked, so. Yeah. Alright, I'm ready to leave when you are. Say the word. You were doing there. I was reaching over for some water and I was pressing D just to move over with my foot and uh, pressed X by mistake. That happens. Probably to do with like when prone to shoot me or something. No. I don't plan on shoot up. shooting you in the back just yet, mate. <laughs> yeah, not yet. That's gonna be uh, <laughs> after you get the flea market, then you can get rid of me. Won't need my help anymore. Ha 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 ha. Maybe a hell of a heel turn, so. Just wanted to get a little bit of stamina back. Fine. I'm just looking for a car battery. Has someone to do. Why do you need one? Nope. But you, you'll need some eventually. I've got some. Yeah, but you'll need like seven. I seven. assume you don't have seven on you. No, I've got like two. But you need like three for therapist, you need like two for the hideout, and then like two more for something else. Mm -hmm. See you, guy. Yeah, it's a scuff. Hey, Toe with the horrible helmet. Yeah. I got killed by a flare scuff here the other day. He like murdered a scav on that ramp up there, dropped down, saw me shotgun to be in the head immediately. There's, speaking of dead scavs, there's a dead scav in here. Oh. Nice quinky dink. That's weird. There's a hat there if you want it. There's a what? A hat. There's a guy coming, by the way. I hear him. That's the way we went. Well, I don't really want to stick around to find out.
looks like I've lost a viewer. That's probably me. Oh. I think I paused your stream. I think Gunny's gonna give you some really good, by the way. But Ash 12. Yeah, Ash 12 is fucking incredible. It shoots pretty much anti tank rounds. So, Ooh. like, if, if you hit those shots, they're gonna fucking break a limb, like, blow off a limb. That's why the bolts are, like, really expensive. They're made to, like, pierce, like, cars and, like, uh, like, uh, engines. Oh, there's a sacred rifle left. That's not too bad. Yep, and I got another customs quest you gotta do. Because, of course, you do. Thought I'd find that first signal one as well. Uh, we can do shoreline now if you want. Yeah, why not? I'll take my shit gun and try to get a couple of scab kills. Oh, I like the look of that. It's a very nice gun. I'm so close to level 15 now. How far you need? I'll tell you in a second, let me just sell some stuff up. Um... Why are you doing that? I'm making some water real quick. Okay.
Alright, are we ready? Um, we'll be in a second. Shoreline 16. Cool. Oh, I've already up by accident. Oops. Let me know when you're ready. There's at least one scav on this map I should be able to kill with the sniper rifle. That's the fucking sniper scav. Well, that's good. Yeah. Hope it doesn't fucking dome you in the head, though. At least, at least I got the face shield to kind of help me. If he domes you in the eyeball, well, you know. It's unfortunate, but... It's not like I've got my best stuff on anyway, so... Yeah, but you want to get the quest done, don't you? Yep. But I won't cry if we... Probably, you know? Hmm. Because I'm pretty sure I just have to touch it, don't I? Yep. Yeah, just you just gotta get in there, get to the roof of the building, run and go touch it, and then you're done. Should go run in a second. I'm still creating in the loot pools. Doing its usual two minute crash. Things going slower. Yeah, it's not great. <clears throat> and did you say you were in now? No, I'm not in. But oh, I okay. heard. I, well, I thought I was going. Cause I heard my character like coughing. That usually means I'm gonna spawn in. But then, uh, some dude's SSD exploded. Now the game's taking forever. Oh, it says waiting for players. 
Damn. Damn. Again, some some dude's SSD exploded. You know what baffles me? Go on. That you don't have this fucking Discord servers muted. What do you mean? I keep seeing you get the fucking pop-ups on your screen. Oh yeah, how do you get rid of those stupid things? You you mute the server. I just have to mute the server for each... If it, yeah, if you mute, mute these servers, you stop getting the pop-ups. Christ, uh, I've been wondering how to get rid of that. Yeah, I just, that's why I mute every server I'm in, because I don't want to get the fucking pop-ups and the dings and the notifications. The game free just mute while when I finish stream. We yeah, do I don't mind it. need to fucking mute them while you're watching my fucking uh, Mass Effect stream. That's what I want to do, I think. Go. Yep. I actually got a fairly decent spawn. I definitely rather spawn here than spawn in that north corner. Oh yeah, that north corner last time. Yeah, we spawned in the uh, south corner this time, which is at least marginally better. Shit. Yeah, I'm on 130 ping, so I'm not doing great myself. Oh my god, I'm being shot at. I see you Fall running. Back. Fall back. I'm behind some his rocks. Gun, his gun is shit. It's not even piercing my armor. Ah, oh, fantastic. Yeah, so just fall back to the road. Oh, crap! Don't do this to me, game. No, 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 no. Or if you just, or if you have to just hide behind a rock, that'll, you know. Ah, oh, fantastic. Yeah, I'm on a, uh, I'm on the road now by an armored car. So yeah, the guy cracked my face shield, but other than that, he barely even pierced my head. Yeah, I'm a bit more worse aware. Hm. I mean, run, just run behind you the road. Or heal yourself before you run, if you need to heal yourself. Which you probably should if you're in the red. Running towards the ammo car. Yep, I, I see it. Yeah, you're running to the car that I'm at. I'm like right here. Yeah. If you need to heal, I can pass you my grizzly. I'm just behind you now. Yeah, to heal, and I'll pass you the grizzly if you need it. Uh, here. Use the CMS kit to fix your arm. And then pass it back when you're done. Oh. You gotta move, fall back. Yep, trying, but I can't move. That's fine. Moving back now. Alright, run, follow me. Because he was shooting the car from the other side, so I think he's trying to scare us. I don't think he has an actual angle on us.
Oh, he's behind this car. You can start healing again. Okay, okay. So you shouldn't have an angle on us right now. Oops. Ah. Uh. Oh. That's not at us. Not at us. That's at us now. They're oh at the god! No! 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 You need to get out of the road, man. Yeah, but I've tried. Crap. Fuck. Just like yeah, 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 yeah. G games is doing dirty on me. Feel your stomach as soon as possible because you're losing food right now because your stomach's bleeding. Yeah. It's like your, your guts are falling out. Hey, let my stomach now. Okay, my and stomach. Then the game, and then the game plan when you're done is we're gonna pop that fence on your right. Right. And then just go forward. And I'll run for a sec, I got the better armor, so I'd be able to take the hit if they do start shooting. Makes sense. And I'll pass you my altitude split in a minute as well, because you fractured your fucking elbow. Uh, my arm's sorted. Uh... S mark. Because you have the heavy bleeding. Well, at least I'll get a load of uh, points for all this. Yeah, heal and XP, it's always good. Yep. I'm glad I brought a fucking CMS kit. Me too, jeez. Kill your thorax. Because if that gets zeroed, you're dead. Okay. Yeah, thorax and header the kill spots. Anything else can go zero and it's not gonna kill you. Just fuck you up, but thorax and header. Uh, zero means you're dead, so. Ah, uh, that's good. I'm back Are to- Are you ready? Yep. Alright. Let's go. Well, say what you will about us, we survived that. That's, you know, kind of impressive, to be honest, that we survived, you know, a pincer attack. Yeah. From two people we didn't even see. Yep. Now, you know what the funny part is? I still gotta fight that sniper's death, so. Ah, oh, great. Is your guy still heavy breathing and coughing? Yeah, I've got... Why? Uh, I've got... Are you I've got pain? a fresh wound on me. Oh. That'll do it. Ooh, prone.
Fall back. Yep. They're fighting the Saber Scout. Well, now we can't fight it, but... You know, I yeah. think we'll get over it. Because the thing is, like, I don't want them to hear your fucking heavy breathing. It's the problem. Nope. This is a hell of a run, isn't it? Yep. So if you fucking encounter the whole goddamn map. Jesus. Okay, get, well. the, get in this ditch and fucking tell me how long that fresh wound's gonna be on you, because I'm getting sick of hearing you cough. Okay, okay. Uh, two, four, one. Oh my god, it's like two, four, or two. It's like four minutes, basically. Uh. Fantastic. There's no stupid way to get rid of it, is there? Uh, not about painkillers. Oh, I could take them out last time. Hmm? I had some in my gamma, but I took them out to put some else in. I mean, painkillers you don't usually need, but when you do need them, that's what they're for. It's not like the coffin. Mm. Or to let you run on broken legs, so that's your two main uses. Well, you know what, let's get in this little dividend right here, and I'll pass you my grizzly. Because I think you can maybe heal your stomach a little bit more off this. Here. Well, it's at 162 now. Good. See ya. I think maybe healing your stomach got rid of some of your pain. There you go. Yep. Alright. I'm just gonna take the, the long and slow way to get into the fucking resort, because, you know, at this point, why not, right? Yeah, I was worse that can happen. I mean, <laughs> there was some guy fighting in there anyway. I heard a grenade's going off, so. Yeah, yeah. But you don't I need to rush it. Too. It's crazy. We've, been, we've only been in this raid for like 12 minutes, by the way. It feels longer. It, 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 I, I know, man. It feels a lot longer. Oh god, now I can see blood. That's not good. Oh, you're late bleeding. Uh, heal yourself in this bush. You know, whenever you have like a fresh wound or pain, uh, you get bleeding. Sometimes when you walk. You, please do it quick, otherwise you're gonna destroy your arms, because they're very fragile. Okay, your arm is broken, not yeah, too yeah, slow. Yeah, yeah, Alright. Alright. Oh. Definitely want some pakers. You have to be diligent to that. Whenever you see you start bleeding when you have CMS arms and shit, you gotta make sure you get rid of that so you don't lose your uh, fresh arms. You know what's annoying me? Is that I think I shot my face mask. I have a huge, like, cracked window shard in my fucking face mask and all my screen. And, like, the dead center. Oh, god, that must be so annoying. Yep. What was I some, like a fucking bird to shit on my fucking face mask? You hear that? I hear like a helicopter. I don't know what that is. Well, it's gotta be coming from somewhere. 
Hopefully not anywhere near us. Uh, or somewhere. I don't know where that somewhere is, though. Oh, we're at the HEP station. Alright, so we're going this way. I'm guessing it's a PvP spot. Uh, that's where the sniper scab was, so those guys were. Uh, okay. I assume they're probably already gone. They probably already... Did they kill the sniper scab? Yeah, they did. I need to realize something. Now that your arm is blacked out again, you're never gonna stop coughing. Yeah. Well, we're here just for your quest. I was going to try to do my quest too while we were here, but now's not the time for it, clearly. So we're just going to try to get in and do yours and get out. I think I might try a different server after this, because uh, this one's lagging like a bitch. Yeah, I mean, I'm on fucking 130 ping, which isn't great. Also, for the record, scabs do spawn here, so, like, I wouldn't mind checking that parking lot for, like, scabs, but, you know. Ah, if we I'm see some, we see some. I'm doing it. see anybody which is what it is I guess <laughs> this is less than 5 minute meters anyway yeah but I could just back up and then shot them as long as I see them before they see me you mm. know All right, we are beelining for this fucking roof to make sure your stamina is like topped off so we can fucking just get our ass up there. Guy. Hmm. Hmm. He definitely hmm. hears you coughing, so we're gonna. Okay, we're gonna fall back. Okay, fall no, back. Fuck your coughing, man. God damn it. The one time we get a fucking ambush on it, guys, the one time you're fucking choking on your own blood. God damn it. I found the scav. Yeah, I think I saw one in there as well. Oh, uh, that was a spawn body, now that a dead body. Alright. This fucking guy. He just had to be taking the fucking exit the one time we need to use it. I wonder why that guy stops. He's like, oh, I got a shot on this guy. And I was like, why do you back off? What's he doing? Why is he sneaking? I'm like, oh, yeah. Maybe this fucker behind me with his fucking coffin. Hello. Ugh. No, this is making me so fucking nervous. I feel like any time I get close, I know there's a chance of like some fucking dude hearing you. All right, let's run. I'm just gonna hope that guy fucked off. That, if I was him, I wouldn't want to sit out in the open like that, waiting for us either. So like, no. let's hope this bunchers are he left and he got into a fight at the village or something like that. Oh man! All right, stay close to the wall so he can't get shot through the windows. And you know what, because I'm fucking annoyed, if that guy was here, because remember, there was a fight here. Mm. So that guy, and the guy who fought and won, and now he's leaving, and that could mean the, the mall or the resort here is empty. So even though it's going to be fucking stupid, if we get your quest done, I'm going to fucking loot here. I don't even care. Okay. If they hear you coughing from seven floors away, you know, oh well. Hey, we could always just find some meds. Upstairs, bro, we're going, we're going through the roof. Going upstairs. 
Yeah, all the way to the top. Oh. And you're right, we couldn't find meds. I do have the key to the two medicine rooms. So. Okay. All right, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna stay by the door. Just run all the way down and go touch that um, satellite dish. I see it. I see it. I see it. I see it. Yep. There's also a weapon box for, there that you can loot as well. Okay. Is it available? No. Just if you, if you check your task menu, it should be done. Yeah, no, mate, this clicks up. Nah, it's one of those quests is glitched. Like, literally, if you just check your quest log, it'll say it's done. Okay. Oh, now the planes come in. Which one is it again? It's out in the list, right? That I means it's done. Oh, it's done on my list, it's done. It's, it was signal part one. What's it say? Just survive an extract? That's your top quest. Survive an extract. Alright, well there you go. So worst case, if you die, we just log back into shoreline and leave. So, the hard part's done. Now we just gotta, you know, loot. Ah. Uh. There's a really good thing called a Thunderbolt in there. Don't know if it's worth it. Uh, can you crab it into your backpack? If I could, I would. Well, tough. So you for bringing the world's worst backpack into the raid. I brought it because I thought, there's a good chance I'm going to die. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, there was, but that's still what you get. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I have 25, 6, and 1 for this floor. And the utility key on me, right? Do I have the utility key? I do, so this door should also open, right? Yep. Uh, tech tape, I'll take that. Uh, bleach, uh, I don't want you drinking that. Not gonna go well for you. <laughs> uh, 325 is not looted. Oh, wait, yes it is. Medical bag, check that for the obvious stuff right here. Have we gone into a different room? Yeah, I went 325, the room I just announced very openly that I had the key for. There's a medical bag that you can open. Oh, yeah. That's not a medical bag. I don't understand how you function as a human being with a memory this awful. I just don't know where the room is, that's all. It's a fucking nameplate from the wall. It literally says 325 right there. I already looted it. Oh, did it have any pink, wasn't it? Had morphine. Ooh. Which is... Yeah, this might do it. It's gonna take like 20 of your food and your water though, but it should get rid of the coffee and I think if you eat that. Uh, still coughing. Give it a minute. Also, oh, now you need food and water really bad. So. Yeah. Alright, I have 20, I think 26. And I have, I have, no, I have like 19, 20, and 26 on this floor, I think. Uh, 19, 20, and 21. Okay. They're all, they're all right next to each other. 21's looted. 20's looted. 19's looted. All right, and then we gotta hop over the barbed wire. Oh god, that's not doing me any favors. Literally doesn't matter. Please, God, hurry up, man. I don't want you fucking pass not dying because of dehydration. Uh, did you go up, down, or stay up, 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 up. up. I'm just gonna keep saying it that we don't fucking get lost in a one shot corridor again. Dump over the hole. Uh, 
One of these rooms should be a medical room. This one. Check these medical bags. Got a fresh eye pack. Good. And I got my quest item. That's good. Ooh. Yanking that. Open this. There's a water or a green tea on that guy. That helps you a little bit at least. And I'll be in 301, which is down this hallway. If you get, if you get lost, look for the name tag. Never mind, it's already looted. Alright, for the first floor, I have no keys for the east side. So that means we just run to the other part of the map, and by map I mean resort. So just fall down this hole. Oh wait, we have to go, yeah, this way. We're just gonna run across this, um, whatever you call this, like the skywalk or whatever. I go. think skywalk's the right word for it. Yeah, I was thinking of skylight, and I was like, you walk through, so it's a skywalk. You can tell I don't go out much. Bridge at best. I have 26 and 16 and 13. So 13, 16, and yeah. I am begging you, please just follow me so you don't get lost and die while eating a Snickers bar. Alright, 12, and that's 14. We looted 13, because of course he did. Okay, so we can't do 13. I have 16 and 26. Don't fall to the floor. 16 is looted, because of course. Um, and 26 is looted, of course. Let's see if he looted the file, or the, uh, yep, he did. Yep. All right, now we go down. And see if you got a marked room. If you got a marked room, I'll be very sad because the medical room. Yep, he did. But we're going to check these bags for medicine anyway, just in case. Nothing. Alright, well, uh, you don't have much time left, so I, I looked for food, didn't find any. We're just going to leave. That way you don't die. Okay. Oh, there's a dead body over here that I assume has no food on it, but I'll check. Of course not. Mission set again. Like, I'm, I'm really hoping these, some of these guys has like a fucking tuna in his backpack. Healing to compensate. Huh? Let them healing to compensate. Oh, you're losing stuff to hungry. Yep. Oh, it's food. Food. Food on that scav. He is a warrior thorough, man. Sometimes you'll find exactly what you need. Oh, that's the greatest piece of Food I've ever yeah. found in life. You wanna go loot the upstairs now? <laughs> I mean I mean, you know, like I'm just saying, you got a time now. Wouldn't hurt to take a look, would it? I don't know, I kinda of like think we've pushed a look here. But if you really want to do it, we'll do it. Okay, here's the thing. We we just found food in our moment of need. You know, that's a good sign. There could be stuff on the third floor that's not looted yet. Uh, what keys do I have for the third floor? Uh, I have six and sixteen. So six, I think, will be back here, right? No, actually. It's gonna be this way. Uh, you can take that weapon crate if you want as well, right there. Okay. Yeah. 
We have eight. We have seven. And he got six. I fucking hate this dude. I actually hope this fucking guy gets, like, sued for war crimes. Like, who the fuck, other than me, comes to the resort with, like, 27 keys on them? And he has only, only the keys that I have, too. Alright, now we gotta find 16. Which I think we can walk around here and then. Yeah. Sixteen. Finally a door that I can open. Finally. Jesus. There's a shotgun in there if you want it. Did you finally stop coughing? No, you're still no. coughing. Seems less bad than before, though. Yeah. Alright, let's go. We came and got everything that I can get. Except for maybe like one utility closet, but like, oh, what the hell? Um. No, not this way either. Uh. Gotta go this way. Why is my guy? Oh, I'm so heavy. I'm losing stamina now when I walk. Oh. Okay, in that case, I'm dropping the shotgun. Fair enough. Yeah, that was why. Actually, wait a minute. We're on the second floor, just- we're on the second floor or the third floor? Hold on, what floor is this? Okay, that was the third floor, alright. <sighs> alright, let's go. Now that was a fucking wild raid, man. Yeah. Not over yet. <laughs> I, I know, I know, but... You know. Sometimes you gotta be audacious, man. You know? Sometimes oh. the only way to get what you want is to choke on your own blood and cough uh, so that the whole map can hear you. Yeah, I mean, it's a unique way of winning, I'll, I'll give myself that. Yeah. Lost both my arms. Three times, actually. Yeah! And your, and your, one of your legs, at least. I'm like that, ma uh, that knight out of Monty Pipe. I never seen Monty Python. Ah. Or Austin Powers. Or Borat. Or like any of those movies. Are you shooting? Yeah, it's at the resort. I assume a scab just spawned in. Because player scabs are probably on the map now. How far to the exfil? Um, probably like three minutes. Okay. Ah oh, shit! Now I'm hungry. Yeah, my guy's starting to black out. Shit, you too. Yep. And you gotta remember, you know, we had we came in with the same hunger and water. 
So, it's just you lost more if you got shot in the stomach earlier, so your guts fell out. Yeah. So now I'm gonna start passing out and maybe dying. Hopefully you make it. Yeah, I agreed. I mean, I can see the X fill, so. And lose stuff. Huh? Are you saying to, uh, yeah, lose health? Yeah, I've been losing stuff. So I'm just gonna start healing when I get too low as we're walking. Alright, well, we're by Scav Island, so we're right next to the Xville. Oh, that's the best X fill I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Whew. Dude, what a fucking raid. Fucking wild from start to finish. I know, right? Pretty crazy. Ugh. Ugh, I'll be honest, I'm glad that's over. Agreed. That was a 36 minute long raid. It felt longer. Honestly, I agree. It felt like an hour. It was a whole fucking ordeal. You know it's gonna be funny though? That's your next quest is if we turn in signal. Is what, sorry? Guess you know what's gonna be funny? Guess your new quest will be if you turn in that signal quest. Go on. It's gonna be signal too. We have to mark those same uh, things again. You have to actually mark them. Yeah, you have to bring markers. You gotta mark the same two, and you gotta mark a third one, which is nearby the first one. Oh, great. So it's just gonna be the same quest twice, basically. Which is one of those things where it's like, at that point, why is it even a quest? Yeah. Whoever designed this game had a bit of a sense of humor, I can think I hate that much. Yeah, I got part two and insider. Which is? Reach level three loyalty with proper. Oh. Uh, actually signal two isn't the marking one, is it? What is that what does that say? It was like a turning quest, I think. Yeah, hand over batteries. Done. Oh, it's that one. Um. And then we need to hand in G phones and C uh CPUs. Yeah. Okay. Well, go to your hideout 
you can make broken G phones in your workshop. So see if you can do that. You need like a G phone and a screwdriver. I assume you probably can't, but wouldn't hurt to check. Well, I got some new stuff anyway. That's something, I suppose. Uh, let me check the thing then. Uh, hide out. I don't have any other things I need, so I need a broken G phone X smartphone. Okay. Broken LC. So basically, so basically you're not going to do them until you get the flea market or you just get really lucky in a raid. Yeah. Hey. Well, let's do a scatter run, I guess. Yeah. They don't make yeah, the blood boil as 10. much. Uh, it's changed, did you say? Yeah, interchange 10. With roughly 100 million scavs looking for a group right now. Doesn't look like too many looking for a group. That, that's a fucking ton, dude. For scavs, I usually see like, at most, like, 3 or 4. Not fucking 12. Hmm. It's quite a few. Oh, I got really excited for a second. I thought my guys were wearing um a tier six armor, but it's just a shitty t-shirt. <laughs> it looked like the fucking slick. I I kind of want to look at your t-shirt. Am I getting? <laughs> really, it has like the same little um like strap part in the middle. that looks like uh, like the bulletproof part of the fabric. Mm. But it was like, oh, it's just a really ugly t-shirt, like ugly jacket. You know what I won't find now? Hmm. I just think CPU. <laughs> I've come yeah, CPUs. I've... I used to come yeah, across... CPUs... Yeah, CPUs are rare when you need them, but they're always there when you don't need them. But I mean, on the bright side, we were already, we were already looting the PCs and stuff anyway, so... Yeah. You know, at least now we can double up. I would just give them to you if they weren't they didn't need to be found in a raid, but you know the game hates you, so. I know. I still find that so stupid that you can't fucking just buy some of the shit for like, um, some of these quests. Like, I think a better system would be like you can't turn in stuff for, that you buy from a trader, like the flea market. But if you have a friend who gives you stuff, that should count as you find them in a, in a raid. Yeah, I agree. That's like you using like your connection to get the item, not like you, you know, outsourcing your work to somebody else. Because like, you know, even though it is kind of BS that like I could give, I could help you do the quest, and like big groups of players could like help their friends do quests. Like, they're still at the end of the day, they're still getting help from like other people who are like, you know, they know. That's not the same as asking like help from like traders and like gangs and stuff. Oh, he's falling in really early. Uh, we spawned by the PCs though, at least, so I guess uh, we'll start by doing this. Yeah. That's good news, yeah. 
that sounded close. Yo, yeah, that's a fucking un understatement. Oh, we can't go this way. Okay, I know where we're at now. I, I was kind of mixed up. That door is unopenable for some reason. I would definitely close that door. Oh, what the <laughs> fuck? I've never been in this office before. I don't even know where the hell we're at. There's a silver weapon box back here, though. What the hell? Ooh. I don't I've even know. I've got a vase. You, excuse me? You do? Yeah. Uh, can I have that? Yeah. Yeah. I don't need that yet, but I will. Sad and fluff, Fuck right? yeah, dude. Here, you know what? Take my AK. Ooh. I just found this. There you go. Thank you. I'll see if these PCs got anything good in them. Yeah, the fact there's a silver box back here. I gotta, I gotta figure out where this room is so I can start checking it. Oh, CPU right off bat. Nice. I network card because I think I need it as well, don't I? You need a what? A network card. The hell is a network card? Um, it's a PCB. Oh, yeah, yeah, you need one of those. Also, look at this. This is not very family friendly. Ah! We got a naked lady, a naked lady back here in this corner, too, who's much hotter than the other lady, in my opinion. And we got the Russian flag. We got another naked, the same naked lady. Uh, why is there soap in this man's office? Seems like a weird thing to have in your back office. So does... Naked ladies. I, I mean, does it... You really can't see like an 80 year old Russian oligarch having half naked young girls in his office? I thought it was like a standard thing in there, I couldn't... Uh... Oh! So if we go into the PC room this way, the whole time... There's an office if you just turn to the left, right there. Huh. I never knew that. All right, hold on. Is there any more doors back here? I, 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 we might as well explore this. This is brand new to me. Okay. Uh, there's a door there. That door won't open. This door leads out to the main room, so just close that door. Then we come through here. Uh, there's a staircase that we're not going to be using. And you can close that door behind you. Okay. And if you come down this way, there's an ominously closed door, which is openable. Oh, uh, this is a boring storage room, though. That's kind of lame. It's so more like a office or whatever. Yeah. Well, either way, I'm quite happy that we found a new office spot with a really good weapon crate in it as well. Can't be too mad about that. And heck, staring at a Russian model that doesn't seem too bad. Agreed. <laughs> and I close this door behind you. Don't forget, though, we're so early in the raid, so some dude would definitely be lurking around this corner at some point. Okay. I check that one PC, and then we are out of here. Empty. Um, let's go this way and then check, like, the, uh, little kiosks, and then, uh, make our way to the back offices on the other side. 
no sense of, you know, going through, like, the... Go. There's a guy. Definitely a scav right there. I don't know if that was a scav for the escalators or not, but I'm not gonna stick around to find out. Agreed. Another guy by that shelf back there. I think it was a, probably a scav, but... Yo, what's up? Uh, I have not, unfortunately. What did he want? Uh, he wanted, he wanted alkaline. Oh. Yeah, it looks like cooking oil, which we haven't seen yet. What was that? You don't need to close those doors, though. Those make noise. Oh. So if they, if they open that door that you close, we'll hear them open it and be fine, but... You know, we don't need to make more noise than we have to. Oh, well, right side, if we do open it, we can hear it. Yep. I think I missed something on that thing there. I'll check in a sec. Okay. Yeah, you did. You missed the PC. I'm getting that. Empty. Empty. Make sure you look at the actual desks themselves, that's where cigarettes can spawn. It's got a can of tuna thing. Yep, I'm already going on to the next room, so... I'm right behind you. There's a guy. I don't know where, but I think he's on the other side of the wall. I heard him open a medical bag. Or like the zipper. leaving after we do this room okay i found a gpu oh yeah uh cigarettes yeah oh never mind bad cigarettes you don't need those ones dude what is my fucking gpu luck right now man i know you're that's, sick right now that's five i found this wipe so far Before you know it, you'll be able to set up your little Bitcoin farm. I never even had that yet in this game. I didn't unlock it last wipe because of fucking Jaeger. Why did Jaeger oh, screw you over? Yeah, because you need Jaeger to upgrade your water cooling to level 2, which you need the water cooling to upgrade your laboratory to level 3, which you need your in to upgrade your intel center to level 2, which you need to upgrade the Bitcoin farm. So Jaeger really blocks that whole process there. Ah, uh, it's a cock blocker. Yep.
Oh, for a minute there, I thought my extraction thing wasn't gonna come up. <laughs> now you gotta, you gotta like fucking put your dick on that tire for it to work. It's a bit weird. A bit finicky. Yeah. Fucking good raid. Sorry, what was that? I was itching my ear. It's a fucking good raid, dude. I know. Fucking GPU, I got a vase that I'm gonna need at some point in front of my fucking Ragman quest. That's one of the quests that I could not do last wipe at all. It just wasn't spawning me the items for it. You need two antique teapots and two antique vases. And I found both vases, but I couldn't find any teapots. So now I just need one more vase when I do get that quest. So I'm very happy with that. Alright, let's uh, do customs now. Okay, spare me a second. I've got some stuff in my. Yeah, I gotta change on my shit anyway, so you got time. Plague mask is worth something. Yeah, a lot. It's like 58k to ride, man. So make sure you don't sell the cigarettes by accident. God, I don't think that's absolutely horrible. Alright, and what's on your mind? Um, put that trailer key thing in your safe pouch, in case we can knock that out on customs. Okay. And I'll bring the uh, Tarkon key. I guess I'm the fucking hearing, that is. The fuck is it? Oh, there it is. I've got a cocktail injector from last thing. Uh, what's it called? What name? Abdelos. Oh, Los. yeah, keep that. That's good. Cause you're gonna get, gonna get a quest from Peacekeeper at some point where he wants like one of every stim in the game. And the only place you can really find these stims are on labs, so if you ever get any of those, like, unique-looking stims, I'd keep uh, at least one of each for that quest. Cool. The only, ones he does, the only one he doesn't want is morphine and adrenaline, I think, so you don't have to worry about those ones. But if it's called, like, weird shit like ETG or, like, SJ1, keep all those. Okay, that's cool.
uh, I've got a military checkpoint key and a Darton room key for 303. Uh, I would sell both of those. You do have a quest in 303, but I already have the key for that, so if you ever do that quest, I'll just bring the key. That military checkpoint's worth quite a bit. How much? Uh, 28350. 28350. In that case, keep it, and I'll check its price in the flea market real quick. If this sells for more than 10k, that means it might be a lot in the flea market. Military checkpoint key? Yep. I would just sell it to Therapist. It sells for 35k on the flea market, so okay. it's not that big of a difference. I, I am ready when you are. Cool. So we need to go to the bunkhouse, which you need to bring the key for. We gotta go to the charcoal office that I have the key for. You need to go... Oh, you have to, you have to go in the dorm, too, for golden swag. Fuck. Um, okay, hold on. Yeah, okay. Well, speaking of the 303 key, we gotta bring that as well. Uh, let's put that back in the key ring. Take that. And I gotta go into the train car. So we, you know, we got plenty of things we gotta do on here, so let's see what we can knock out. Uh, let's see, which one did I need for that one, for that quest? Uh, oh. it's like a portable bunk key. Has like a black top. Uh, is it that one? Or the uh, B one? Nope. And where the fuck is it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have a black top at least. Looks kind of like a car key a little bit to me. But there it is, I see it. Right above oh, yeah, your yeah, capacity. Yeah, I see it, I see it, I see it. There we go. Got it. Yep, just put that bad boy in your uh, safe pouch. And also, eat some food and water, man. You're in a bad spot. Oh, god, yeah. That could have been bad. You should probably also just have the game auto store your inventory. That way you have less, uh, like awkward spacing. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's done. Alright, I think I'm gonna just redeem them. No, 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 scroll back down. The game fucked you over, it's stupid. Go all the way down. Move that one fucking pilgrim to the right by one, then move the other pilgrim up by like five. That'll give you like a way better storage area at the bottom. I don't know why the game sorted that so weirdly. Like that? Yeah, and then move the other one up. See, now you got way more space at the bottom for actually like putting shit down there. Yeah, I do. There you go. Cool. Uh, twelve. Yeah, customs, and I should be ready. Uh, I think I was ready when I just saw what my rig was on. Um. Uh, Oh yeah, that's uh, uh do honestly good good on that rig for saving your life, and that shoreline raid. Yeah, it did its job. I'm pretty proud of it. Yeah. Uh, Worth it. 
I thought I would just sell it. Yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I'll just sell it and then see if Ragman will sell you the armor that I usually use. Because I don't know if he sells it to you at level um, 1 or not, but he does sell tier 4 armor to me at least. You mean that one? UK armored rig. Nope. That's tier three. Uh that's probably the best one on here. Uh that's expensive though for only tier three. I would just buy the shitty armor you usually wear. At uh, that okay, point. Because okay. yeah, like you know. Because the armor I use is seventy eight K and it's only twenty K more than that tier three. So it's not that bad like bad for me, but the difference between if I'm if I'm paying twice the price for something, I better be, you know, better than tier three. You know, yeah, it's no. pretty bad, pretty shite, as they would call it. I'm not, cool. I'm not even I'm not even bringing like a proper backpack since we're just doing a quest run, but you can bring that backpack if you want. Oh my god, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, that's a good point. Uh yeah. I'm only bring one of the shitty twelve K backpacks that Ragman sells. So if he lose that, you know, who really cares? I can't even get a shitty rig to be fair. Yeah, the uh, bank robber. That's what I'm using. Yeah. Because, you know what? I, I don't want to leave the good stuff. By the way, we did the tanker quest, right? Uh, where you run up and put the markers on the tanker quest. Yeah. Um, yeah, that one. So yeah. I, haven't done, I haven't done that yet. I've, I've done that one. Alright, so we can... I have two markers we can do. So if you know where two of them are on the way there, point them out and I'll mark them. Okay. Uh, have you done some already? Alright. Because the thing is, if you turn that quest in, you lose point zero one rep with Jaeger, so I can't turn it in anyway, even if I, even if I do do it, so I've been putting it off. Because I need my rep to be precise with Jaeger so I can do my upgrades. I don't want to risk losing any rep with him being locked behind another fucking horrible Jaeger quest, you know? Yeah, I know what you mean. You don't have that problem because you paid the win, so I don't have that luxury of starting off with point two with every trader. I wish Jaeger would get fucking lined up against the wall and shot. I fucking hate him for burning passion. He is a shit person, just in general. Like, who in fucking Tarkov is allowing him to live? Like, why has he not been fucking whacked yet by, like, a fucking scav gang? One o'clock yet? Uh, 13. Yeah, 13, that's what I meant, sorry. I don't mind one in the morning, but we're not gonna be able to see for shit. Probably some dude with night vision goggles on us to the left. Yeah, at least with interchange, like even at, even at night, I feel like interchange isn't that dark, even at night time. Mm -hmm. But if you go on, if you go on fucking woods man or like fucking customs, it's like fucking pitch black. It feels like. Show sure, that. Oh well. Almost at 50. If you do any of these quests, that should get you pretty close to it. I think I'm one quest away from being level 23. I need 24 to get a uh, tier 3 therapist. Is that when you get like uber good st medical stuff? Uh, no, but it's when I can uh, upgrade my medical bench to level 3, which I need to get my intel center to level 2, which I need to get my bitcoin farm in my, like, brewery. I think at tier 3 she sells some weird shit. 
I just saw you like a really good backpack that's huge, but I can only carry medical supplies, which is like, why the fuck would you ever want that? That's really fucking stupid. And she'll like offer to trade you for a thick case, but it costs like fucking 17 mil to still trade for it. So, again, what's the point? There'll probably some, be some quests where you have to carry a load of medical supplies or something like that. I mean, maybe. I mean, the most important thing for me with getting here to level 3 is that that means at one point I can unlock the fucking um, other quest she has to give you a free thick case for free. Mm. That's like a 20 million dollar item. Alright, well hopefully we spawn at the Tarkon office. That'd be nice. That would be nice. Now when I look of it, it'll be on the other side of the map. I mean, if it is, it's not the end of the world, but I have an easier time running uh, to the underground bunker exfil than I do the roadblock usually. I didn't bring a CMS kit, by the way. I forgot. So, don't get shot. Okay. I'll, I'll do one thing in this game that I've always done. Not get shot. I mean, at the, at the very least, don't get shot to the point that your fucking arm falls off. But you, you can get shot, just don't make your shins explode. You know? I'll, I'll, I'll get into aim for body armor. How about that? I mean, well, depends on the kind of gun they're using. It might pierce your fucking liver. Hopefully it's some noob if that doesn't know any better. Yes, that guy'd probably be on your level. Might be able to take him out. I'm still a little bit mad that, that fucking guy looted the resort, got away, because he heard you fucking coughing, so we lost our ambush chance. I'm so mad about that. So I had a fucking headshot lined up on his fucking left ear. And I was like, oh my god, this could be my moment to get a fucking kill. And he just hears you go... <laughs> Dude, fucking turned around immediately. I'm like, ah, oh, shit. Uh, well, there's one tanker. Yeah. yeah he spawned at the front office, that's good. Right, I'll, I'll tell you whether you have a couple out of them. So there's one at the old gas station. There's one at the new gas station, if you know what I mean. Yep. And... I can't remember what the other one is. No, we'll get figured out at some point. I think it's somewhere, like, really obvious, though. Uh, I think there's a fuel tanker by the oh, back horse. Oh, I, I know what it is. Y mm. You know, the thing where you have to get the bronze watch. Yeah, I just said that, by prop for his car. Yeah. Yeah. That, that is also a tank. Alright, this shouldn't be that bad, then. I'm more worried about the old gas station, to be honest, all the scavs. Yeah. Alright, your Ravis card should be on one of the, like, shelves in here. Like, right here, I think, in this room. One of the shelves, did you say? Yeah, like, on the ground? Is there, like, a thing on the ground there? Is there, like, a big box? Oh, yeah. There we go. There you go. Let's go. Got it. I 
I went the other way. The, the way we came in. Yep. There's guys over there, if you couldn't tell. Yep, there's a lot of shooting going on. Yeah, maybe we try to hug the wall and then go around that way instead of going straight. Makes sense. Probably gonna, yeah, it's probably gonna be safer. Also, you're on negative 100 stamina, so like we're gonna hide in this bush for a minute. Don't crouch. Now we're gonna stand up, you're gonna lose stamina again. So I stood up now. Yeah, that's. Yeah, if you don't have to crouch in this game anymore, or like prone, don't do it because you lose stamina when you get back up. I, I, I know. It's not our problem. If there wasn't a guy nearby, I'd take the shot for the XP, but, you know. I know. I'd rather not give away our spot when there could be people around here. Now, here's my question. Do you want to go to dorms, or do you want to not go to dorms? I don't think we need to go to dorms, do we? Well, for your quest, you do. Uh, oh. We gotta go on 303 for the golden swag. Let's get to dorms, then. Alright. Just, just, just so you know, that grenade that went off just now is at dorms. Uh, that didn't surprise me in the slightest. You know, how about this? No. Let's skip dorms. Let's try to get your portable bunk quest done so we get two quests done for you and then grab my quest on the way. That's perfect because it's like, you hear, you hear, like you, Yeah, like you hear that gunfire. It's uh. Seems like a poor time to try to go to dorms. Idea where you disappeared after. Let's go for the trees. My trees and bush. This bit. Come on. There's only oh, so many ways you can go in that bush. Yeah, I'm pretty sure your quest is like past this wall here by Crap Horse fucking vehicular. Right up here. Yep. You can go in here. Yep. I see it. There's right in front of here that staircase right there. Just run, open that door, and it should be like a file on the uh, desk in that room up there. And I'll wait here while I wait for you. Getting shot. Yeah, no. They're fighting at the uh, scab base. Oh, they shot at you. Yeah, they got me. Fuck. Are you dead? Yeah, I'm dead. What? As soon as I got in, I went down like a bag of bicks. Wow. Fuck, all right, well. Got me right in the head, apparently. Head and jaws. Yeah, it's like, yeah, it's like four scabs fighting like a player. So, I'm just gonna, you know. Yeah, yeah, you do what you need to. I'll try and remember where that other, uh, I guess, thing is for you. If you want to still do that. I mean, if it's on the way, like, we're gonna play customs again after this anyway, so, like. It's not that big of a deal. Hmm. I found a dead player on the ground. Yum. He had nothing on him, though. Ugh. Dead. You're dead. Yep, ran to the player who killed him. Uh Yeah. Fantastic. Really cool. Love this game, man. It's 
fantastic. Really cool, fun, and unique. I love when I get shocked and across the map by someone I can't even see and die instantly in one hit as I'm opening a door on animation I can't cancel. Yep. Fun game. Fun game for fun people. Yep. Yep. Well, on that note, I think I want to leave it there and go to bed, mate. <laughs> Alright, fair enough. <laughs> well, I guess I'm done as well then. Yeah, uh, I'll watch you on stream for a bit. Alright. <laughs> I'll get my s uh, I'll get uh, the uh, small dick sound alert ready for you. Hell yeah! I love it, man. Tiniest cock in the galaxy, right here, baby. Yeah. Wait, he was wearing that penis helmet. I gotta compensate for it somehow. I know, man. I know. I don't know, that's why a fucking Liara and uh, Trainer wouldn't fuck me. My fucking two inch cock wasn't gonna do it for him. <laughs> yeah, we're like, oh, well, that's small. Yeah. Is that an earthworm? Might be nice my fucking. Gamecast were to open. Alright, hold on. My fucking shit's not working. I'm gonna restart my computer. I'll just talk to you in like five minutes when I do a live. Yeah, I'll speak to you then, mate. Alright, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.